hello everyone and welcome back to my channel so in today's video i am giving you guys a time lapse of me designing my sneakers so i want to talk about a little bit of the process that i went through in order to complete my sneakers so i started just brainstorming of what ideas i can do for the sneakers um it took me a bit of time in terms of planning so i looked at different things from sea creatures to different color palettes and just other different things of inspiration. I looked at a bit of graffiti as well. And what I started doing first was kind of doing sketches to get my creative juices flowing, but also kind of brainstorm a bit of ideas and also just have a set color palette that I wanted to work with. And the color palette I wanted to really work with was orange and blue, which are complementary colors. And that color palette is based on specifically a certain type of sea animal that I've seen. And I wanted to do the shoe design or to design the shoe based off of that sea creature. And it is called the Mandarin Fish. And the Mandarin Fish is in the ocean and it has these very cool shades of blue and orange. And I also wanted to really do a design based on fully of the patterns of the Mandarin fish. So I wanted to incorporate that in the shoe as well. And this was actually a really fun project that I've ever done. Um, I'm really proud of how they turned out. So I want to talk about how I got started. So the first thing I did was to prep my sneakers. So I took out the laces and I started to use acetone to prep my sneakers. And so after that, I started painting the gradients of blue on top of my shoe. And then I started doing as well, just applying the oranges on certain areas of the shoe. I started applying also the patterns of the mandarin fish. So I wanted that to be the main focus in a way but I also incorporated you know the name of my brand which is Asiatic Bird on top of the shoe so it kind of just stands out. I've also wanted to talk about the Angelus leather paint that I use which was one of the main mediums that I used and with this paint I've used this in the past I've used it on different things like purses and boots and it's a really fun medium to work with and I think that before you work with the leather pen you always have to prep your surface anything that's leather you know say for example you're working on you know a pair of sneakers yourself but the first thing you have to do is prep it and the way you prep it is you can use regular acetone and so some of the colors with the leather paint are translucent, but most of them have a very good vibrancy to them. They're very, you know, rich in pigment. And the thing is, is that it's good to put on. It's, it's very easy to apply. It's not very thick. It's, it's very, you know, thin enough to where you can do layers. And you can also always water down some more if you feel like it's not thin enough. And so, like I said, it's a very fun medium to work with, and I really enjoyed working on this project. So that's my whole process in terms of my whole sneaker. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel. Be sure to turn on your notifications every time I post a new video. And I hope you guys enjoy this video. Take care, stay safe, stay healthy. And until the next video.